I think what makes City Week such an important event um, for the financial services industry is that it, it, it really brings the industry together in a unique way. So it's a blend of policymakers, regulators, industry players from different sections of the industry and the professional services firms. And each of us kind of, I guess, have a different perspective and a slightly different way of approaching the same issues. Uh, and I think City Week allows that blend of perspectives to be brought um, across to the audience. So I think certainly whenever I've been to, to City Week, um, it, I come away thinking about things in a slightly different way. Uh, and I, I guess, I'm challenged sometimes to think about things in a different way. So I th for me, I think that's the, the, the kind of key thing that, that makes me always want to attend. So I, uh, I was moderating uh, a panel on the greening of finance and financing green. Um, and I think probably most people uh, don't need me to tell them why that topic is so significant. Um, uh, but, but, and it's not just because I moderated the panel that I'm saying this, um, but I think, you know, that the, the, the industry is absolutely key uh, to tackling the direction of the global climate change emergency that we're facing. It is the number one topic um, that the industry needs to be focusing on. That's not to say other things aren't important, uh, but it isn't a special interest topic. You know, it, it literally affects everyone. Um, and so I think for me, I felt very lucky to be able to be talking about um, a topic that is firstly something I'm working on <clears throat> and dealing with a lot, but also that it's, it's just so close to my heart. So, um, so yeah, so perhaps it's a vested interest, but for me, I, I thought it was um, a, a great panel for me to be moderating. So I think that's one of the key standouts, isn't it, for City Week is it, and amazing to be doing it uh, at a time when there's lockdown and the constraints we find ourselves in in different countries and some are freer than others. But I think everyone got together uh, and the, 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 the breadth of perspectives um, and the, the way that some sessions tackled issues uh, and sometimes similar issues were tackled in slightly different ways um, by really, you know, um, leading lights in our industry or, or um, really significant regulators, key politicians. Um, I think that, you know, it never fails uh, to impress, but I think particularly given the circumstances we find ourselves in, the breadth of the topics and the range of speakers was, was very impressive. Well, um, the digital platform, my experience, so I, I, we'd all like to have been there in person, wouldn't we? Um, or at least I think most people would probably say that. Um, but I have to say kudos um, to, uh, for, for, for those who, who planned the digital um, experience, the digital platform, because it worked really well. Um, I think, that, you know, if, if there were any glitches, it was probably user error. Um, uh, and I think it did give a sense of main stage and networking, um, which I have to say I, I thought was going to be uh, quite challenging. So I think the, the, the thought and the care that went into how that worked, um, I was very impressed by. Um, but fingers crossed for in-person next year. lots of different things uh, but you don't want me to reel a list off so for me I think the two core cool things that, that I've been thinking a lot about and that I'd like to see addressed at future events um, one is around kind of purpose and culture for our industry that's not to say it hasn't been talked about before but I think it is increasingly going to be something that as we move through <laughs> and hopefully at some point out of COVID you know the fundamental changes that our industry is going through um, the place in society, how clients uh, and consumers will regard the industry, the, the part that we play. Um, I think, you know, uh, that's going to have to be something that we keep discussing, we keep challenging ourselves on and trying to understand. So I think there'll be different angles to that, but, but certainly that purpose and culture point for me is, is absolutely key. And then uh, I guess the, the sustainable finance and, and, and the way in which the industry uh, needs to play its part in terms of um, climate change it is just a perennial topic um, and certainly you know the, the, the sort of boards I speak to it's the number one thing they're talking about so I'd, I'd like more um, conversation and more events focusing on that as well. <laughs> 